I'm Nick Funditis from Royal LePage Performance Realty, and you're watching The Buyer Blueprint. This is a step-by-step -step guide on how to buy your first home. So step three of The Buyer Blueprint is called Offer and Negotiation. I'm not actually gonna spend a lot of time on this video, so this is gonna be a shorter one. Not because it's not important, but actually the reverse. Uh, this is the most important phase of your whole purchase process, and there's a whole bunch of different ways this can go. Uh, so it deserves sort of it, its own subsection of videos and sort of resources. But I'll cover in a straightforward manner what the negotiation is here. In, or sorry, I should say, as a realtor, I can help you in all areas of the process. But if you only had me for one part of it, this is what you want a realtor for. Uh, you know, if we work full time, we are trained in negotiation. This is this is where we live, and this is how we help you get you the best price and terms for the house that you are interested in. I should say, house or property. Uh, the key points of an offer are, uh, of course, price, terms, and these include things like dates and conditions. And then, lastly, there are many strategies that can be used. Uh, but with your agent, you're going to choose one to. Uh, you know, we're gonna choose one to suit the situation. There's different ways that we can approach any offer. You know, what price should we offer? What terms are we gonna ask for to protect you? Okay, so your realtor's role here is to negotiate the best price of terms. You form a plan and stick to it. So if we've been communicating well ever since the preparation stage and uh, through the home search stage, so steps one and two, then we know the plan. Um, I'm going to help remove negotiation or remove emotion from the negotiation and help you stick to your plan so you're not paying too much for a house that you've fallen in love with. And then your lender is just standing by for instruction at this point. So the keys in the negotiation stage are just to negotiate without emotion to be able to walk away from a bad offer. The things that you have in here, let's just repeat price, deposit, closing date, inclusions, and conditions. Here in Ottawa, it's certainly um, certainly different all over the place, but in a, in a regular offer in Ottawa, in a balanced market, uh, the conditions we see most often are inspection, uh, financing, and then if um, if you're buying a condominium, review of the status certificate by a lawyer. But uh, lots more resources if you go below in this, in this page on my site. So let's just stop here. A uh, deposit needed, at least here in Ontario, uh, a deposit has to go with the offer. I don't know if it's that, the same all over the world, uh, but I would think my contract law is probably not that different in different places. Here in our local market, uh, the deposit is applied to the eventual purchase price of the property, and it's a good faith deposit. So it's money that you're putting with, with the accepted offer, uh, saying it's getting held in trust, by usually by the other brokerage, and at the end of the purchase, it either gets applied to the purchase price or during the conditional period, if you walk away from the offer, it's coming back to you. Uh, a healthy deposit here is anywhere from about one to 5% of the purchase price. If 5% seems, if you do the math and figure that 5% is a pretty high number, it is. And usually we only see deposits that are that high on residential properties when, uh, when, when we have multiple offers, a situation like that. So, and the last little bit on there just says that they're refundable. They are refundable if certain conditions are met. So if you walk away in good faith on the offer because you weren't able to fulfill one of the conditions that you've written in there. So that concludes the section on negotiations. Lots more information there. Uh, if I haven't, if we're at a stage where I haven't completed the, you know, all the resources below yet, you can always reach me at nick at nickfunditis.ca or just call my cell at 613-400-2000. I will be happy to talk to you about negotiation strategies. Take care and I'll see you in the next section, which is step four. That's the conditional period. Thanks for watching that video. To see the other steps in the series of the buyer blueprint, simply go to nickfunditis.ca and look at our resources page.